Hey guys, welcome to the vlog. Today is Monday, September 27th. It is Ollie's first birthday, which is my golden retriever, Maya Joshua's, uh, if you didn't know. And we're gonna be celebrating him tonight. So yeah, I hope that you enjoy this vlog. I'm not quite sure what it's gonna entail yet. Um, I really wanna film like a week in my life. Let me know if you wanna see that type of video down below. And if you like short vlogs or long vlogs, cause I'm kind of stuck in between, like if I wanna do shorter, like, 10 to 15 minute vlogs or if i want to do longer like 20 plus minute vlogs so let me know what you think by the way if you are new around here thank you so much for clicking on the video i really appreciate it and if you're a returning subscriber thank you so much for coming back for another video if you are new make sure to hit the subscribe button so you can join the fam and then give the video a thumbs up if you like it and want to see more content like this okay let's get into it starting off the target haul you guys we're going to start off over here I did get some ground turkey and then also just some Parmesan chicken that I can cook for us um, in the next few days. And then I got some almond milk. I got these cute little um, baking dishes so I can make like some dessert type things. I'm not sure what I'm making it yet. If you got any ideas, let me know. Um, but something like small and individual where I could just do, I wouldn't have to do like a big batch of something. Got some guacamole because we absolutely love having chips and guac. Got some fruit, so blueberries, strawberries, and bananas because Ollie loves all of those. So do we, but this is mainly for him, for his um, little cupcakes that we're going to be making. Got some vanilla extract. That is for a pumpkin cold brew that I'm going to be trying out. So I'll be maybe showing that in a vlog for you guys. Got some bagels, instant oatmeal. I love the Good and Gather brand. I feel like they have really good stuff. Like I love getting their almond milk and I never get any other almond milk. Um, got some flour, baking powder. That's for Ollie's cupcakes. I saw these two and I am so excited to try creamy chipotle sauce and this um, chicken dipping sauce. We do have some like frozen non-meat like tenders in our freezer right now so i would love to make them and try this out and then i got a restock of this pumpkin spice latte creamer it is non-dairy which i love i do not like having dairy in my creamer um i'm just so used to an almond based creamer because i've been using it for so many years and this is seriously so good i did get a um starbucks cold brew the vanilla sweet cream so i could use it for that pumpkin cold brew like coffee recipe um got some cooking spray got these really cute oven mitts i haven't had like an actual pair of oven mitts like this in a good while so i picked these up and i will make sure to link everything for you guys like if you're interested you can check it out um, i got ollie this broccoli he seriously loves it i've got him one before and he loves it so much he did destroy it but it's okay it's his birthday so i got him another one and then we love the bark super chewer um toys because ollie loves to chew he's a golden he has some pretty big teeth and yeah this is perfect for him joshua did say it had like a certain smell so oh yeah oh my gosh it smells like <clears throat> it smells like peanuts oh yeah there you go peanut scent so we got that and this is gonna be a part of his like birthday gift and then I just got this drying mat, which I really needed one. So I'll wash this and then use this because right now we're just using like towels, clean towels, uh, hand towels to put our clean dishes on. But yeah, that was the quick Target haul. I'm going to put this stuff up and then we are going to get started with the recipe. Guys, this little dog cap that Joshua got Ollie. Um, it's so cute. You put the ears in it and then you just strap it in the back. We're gonna try to put it on him along with a birthday bandana that my sister got him. So we'll see if he lets us. Maybe if we feel like bribe him with his cupcakes. Set the um, oven to preheat at 350 and we're gonna go ahead and jump into the recipe. Oven is ready. We've got a half a cup of flour and then it says half of a teaspoon of baking powder. I think I'm just gonna mash the banana first. So I'm just gonna, I could have, oh. Yeah, kind of open that a different way, but it, it's fine. Okay, there we go, got our banana. So 
So you need to add in a quarter cup of peanut butter. And then let's see how this comes down. Straight up scoop it. That's, that's a lot of peanut butter. So we're also gonna add an egg. I, I like this, I feel like I'm, I feel like I'm on a cooking show. I don't know how they do these things like live though. That's that's interesting. It says just a little bit of water, so I'm just gonna reuse this. All right, a little bit of water right there. Okay, so now it just says to whisk this together, which peanut butter is kind of thick. All right, cool. So pretty good consistency right there. Kind of the perfect texture and consistency. I'm gonna actually throw in some blueberries because he really likes blueberries. So this ice cream scoop that I've used like once is about to come in handy. Ooh, there we go. One thing about cupcakes is I've only I mean, I don't make them often, so I don't know how much is an ideal amount to put. All right, guys, this is how the cupcakes turned out. I think they all cooked pretty well. Um, I think this one may need just like a little bit more, um, but I'm gonna set that one aside, or I'm gonna set the other ones aside, let them cool, and then put that one back in the oven for a little bit. Hey guys, quick overview of Ollie's birthday gifts. Um, his birthday is Mickey Mouse theme and we got him a bag and some little decorations. We didn't really have time to put them up. Um, but yeah, this is some of the gifts. We're really excited to give him the spider. We really don't give him plush toys ever because we know he'll destroy them. But because it's his birthday and this one seems super fun, we're going to. And then we got, um, I think this one's from Target. Again, I will link everything that I can find down below for you guys. But really excited. And then my sister got him that birthday boy bandana and hopefully he lets us put it on him. Hey guys, okay, so I'm super excited. I'm adding this in, like this is from a different day. Today is October 4th and Story sent over their Emerge collection, like their part two of it that's launching on the 16th of this month. So I'll have all the details on the screen for you guys. But we're gonna do an unboxing and, or unbagging. And I'm really excited because I waited to open this up like until I was on camera. Um, so I'm really excited because I don't know what's in here. Ooh, a sports bra. This is the opposition bra and onyx. I like that's in a size six, which is perfect. That's my size. I like that square look of this bra. That's really cute. 
simple. They got the cute little logo back here. So I can't wait to wear this. So there's that. And then we got the opposition tank. Ooh, okay, so this is like new. This is in Midnight. Love this color. So I feel like navy is just a really great staple color um, and it'll look good on everybody's skin tone, but this is the opposition tank. And then same thing, kind of that straight neckline right here. Um, I don't know if I'm saying that right. I'm, it looks like it's gonna be a good fit in terms of like not being too long. Opposition tight. Okay, so opposition is new to emerge part two. Um, I don't think they've had anything with the name opposition before. This is a midnight. Which so beautiful. I'm all for matching sets. Let me know if you feel the same way. I think that they just look so cute together. Ooh, no way. This one's seamless. Like, I mean, sorry, it doesn't have a front seam. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited to try these on. And then they have a nice pocket on the side and it's like, it has that detailing on the side, but it is a just overall solid color, solid blue. Wow. I really like these. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. I'm training legs tomorrow, so I don't even know like what I'm gonna pick from this. Um, next thing is the Opposition Fitted 4-inch Short in Onyx, size four. Yes, I've been needing some more like just staple black shorts. I feel like you look really cute when you throw on a tee over it. Um, like you just have a t-shirt on and like some cute black shorts that fit you good. Ooh, these are nice. Again, no middle seam, so I know you guys are gonna be so excited for this. Oh my gosh. And then their four inch, I feel like it's really nice in terms of it's not too short where like your butt's gonna be hanging out, but it's not too long. The material is just so buttery soft. It feels so good. It looks like it's an off-white. Let's see, what is this? This is the Opposition Long Line Bra in the color Cloud, size six, which is perfect for me. Oh yeah. Oh, this is the top Katie's been wearing. Oh my gosh. Okay, so I'm really excited because Katie's been wearing this top. It looks so good on her. It has this really pretty cross back right here. And I think it's coming up more white than it actually is. It's more of like a off-white color. Again, the name is Cloud, but it has that cross back right there. And then this detailing, which it is attached in the front right here, but in the back, it kind of gives you that little open look, which, wow, so cute, so pretty. I think I might wear this tomorrow for my leg day. I don't know, but then should I save it for upper body day? I just don't even, I don't, I'm, I'm way too excited. Okay, and then I think this is the last piece out of um, what they sent me. Opposition fitted six inch short in midnight. So love that midnight color. I think that it's just such a staple. Pretty blue that is going to be timeless and it's something you're going to be able to wear over and over again. And this kind of reminds me of the Perseverance short for sure. So they sent these in a size six, which is actually a little too big for me, but that's okay. I'll just let them know about it. Um, these are going to be without the middle seam as well. It's a nice fitted look, but it's not fitted to where it's going to like suffocate you almost i don't know if you guys have had leggings like that where they just feel way too tight on your waist like you can't wear them aside from a workout and i feel like these i can wear all day long like even with a food belly you know like after i've been eating a lot which i have a full day of eating coming soon so stay tuned for that but yeah oh so nice i'm so excited and i'm so grateful to katie and the story team thank you so so much it just honest, honestly feels like such a blessing to be able to see this package and try out these pieces and share my opinions with you guys um but yeah i hope that you enjoyed this little unboxing slash unbagging and let me know which piece is your favorite i'm gonna have to say this top like I'm obsessed. I can't wait to put it on. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. That's actually going to conclude this video. Definitely give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this content and make sure you hit the subscribe button so you can join the fam. And it does also help out the channel. So yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Thank you so much for watching. Hi buddy. Okay, come here. Come here. Come. Okay, sit. Okay, stay, stay buddy.